Today I'll be showing you how to make a fun, unique looking lamp out of a modern day shotgun. First off, I'm going to show you how to disassemble this Remington 12 gauge semi-automatic shotgun. So first of all, we're going to unscrew it back here, slide it off, there should be three pieces in there if I get them out. There they are. All right. That's what the three pieces look like. Got a, a washer, a lock washer, and then that's the end. And you can see that there's actually a hole that we drilled through. I'm going to turn it around. And actually that hole is where the cord for the electricity is going to run. So we'll just set all this aside right now. All right. We need a little screwdriver and we're going to pop the spring that's out in here. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold the top down and then you're going to use this to pop out this little piece right here. And then the spring should pop out. There it is. I'm going to set that aside. We're not going to need, we're not going to need that anymore because actually the uh, electric cord is going to run through here. Third, we have to unscrew the top. Basically, we're going to take that electric cord and it's going to run through here, through this part, <clears throat> and then up and through here. Right here, we take this straight edge. The straight edge is because the buttstock is at an angle to shoot. We want to make this straight so that the gun is going to be straight up and down. The straight edge on the tape will allow us to cut this with a wood saw. That way, when it sets on the base, it'll be straight up and down. And the cord's been threaded through the whole gun. This basically is the bottom of the platform that the gun's going to be sitting on. You can see this is the cord that you're going to be, the end that you're going to plug in. This is the top of the platform that the gun is going to be actually sitting on. This is the bottom of the gun. And if you remember that little nut with the hole in it, that's going to slide right in here with those two little washers and get screwed in. <clears throat> the cord runs through here into here. This is where that spring was that we popped out. Cord runs through this little mechanism. This actually moves around a little bit. Well, it was moving around, so you'll have to kind of fiddle with it to get it past that. Out the top right here and then into the barrel to where it comes out the end. And that's where the light's going to be. All together now. Looks pretty good, actually. It's starting to look like a lamp. That's what it looks like at the bottom. You can see the, the cord is already through. And we screwed the, uh, the bottom of the gun in with these two large anchor screws. And the cord should, is running all the way to the top. You can see it sticking up right there. So now we just have to finish it off with the uh, light socket.